Yo, it's Loza2 and welcome to the Justimon OTK combo deck because this combo, while it kills your opponent, it just doesn't quite do enough. You can see we're at 10 memory here. We've got a level 5 on field and I'm going to show you how much memory this combo takes. First thing we're going to do is Digivolve into Justimon. Actually, you know what? We can cheat a little bit. This Marvin gives jamming, so we're able to actually mine link under here. We now have jamming. You could swing this in, but I'm going to show you without that. So you, you don't actually need that attack there. We're going to Digivolve into the Justimon right here. And we're going to choose to gain 2k even though we do have jamming. We're going to swing in and we're going to activate one of his when Digivolving effects. This one is to un suspend. You just need one tamer really and Justimon. Bonus tamers mean you get bonus triggers of the effect. But you can do it all with just one tamer as long as you can go into your Justimon. We're now going to Digivolve into Excel Arm. Putting the Blitz Arm back in the hand. This, of course, has already cost us 4 memory, right, coming off a of level 5. But now we have piercing and security attack plus 1. We're going to swing in and use the Justimon Excel Arm effect. And that's going to let us Digivolve into Blitz Arm from our hand, which lets us activate Blitz Arm to unsuspend. We're now going to be checking 2 at 13k with jamming. We've restood, of course, so we can swing in again for another two checks. We're still keeping the security attack plus one, but we're able to restand once again, thanks to our when attacking effect, triggering another one digivolving effect, meaning we can now swing for game. But you can see that cost us six memory just to do that combo. If you take into account all the other memory needed just to get to our level six on the our level five on the field, you can see how this deck is in desperate need of some support. Even when I built the deck to absolutely just find all of its pieces, make sure there's a black tamer out, and you know, Unga Bunga swing for five, the deck still feels really bad because it needs to find one level six blitz and one level six excel arm. And needing two level sixes on top of an or like a stack is sometimes just too much to ask for. Usually by the time you get to your Justimon combo to OTK, your opponent has already killed you, or they've set up a blocker, especially in EX7, where Mother D Reaper Shoto is running around. But I I just wanted to showcase this deck today and ask if anyone has a better build of it because goddamn, I've been trying so many different builds and I just can't get this thing to work. I've tried black hybrid builds, I've tried more cyborg machine focus builds like this, I've tried more Ukomon focus builds, I just can't get this thing off the ground. Now of course we have the Justimon Ace coming up, but that doesn't really help this strategy of the deck at all. In fact, it kind of leans into a whole new strategy using all like the chess piece support device card. I don't really know what to make of all that stuff. It definitely doesn't support the the OTK build though. This hand isn't that bad. I'm actually going to hold on to it. We're playing second too, which is nice. We do need that extra card. But we're versing Agumon slash Greymon and they've just thrown us three memory to pass. So not quite ideal for them, but we do love to see it for us. We might just go black memory boost to see if we can get a different rookie to put on the stack or something. I'm even happy to take here. Hagumon X here is really nice. It's a free draw basically whenever we can Digivolve on a Hagumon on field, which is pretty huge. All right, nice. We picked up one of the Justimon pieces. And I think the best thing to do here is give our opponent two memory. So we're going to do that. Did you open a hover SP in the back? Just give over two. And yeah, that's about it. Now, of course, a lot of our fours don't have inheritables, but I don't know. I'm just trying to play the best ones I could. Okay, they're swinging with that Ogumon hitting Setsuki, which is really nice for us. Cool boy. Oh, they're playing the Black War Greymon OTK variant. Oh, no, no. What? <laughs> Okay, I don't know what they're playing, but uh, alrighty then. This is an, an interesting build. I thought it was Black War Green 1 OTK, and now I, I don't know what to think. Alright, we've actually drawn a level 5, which is kind of good. We, we're not actually playing Rio for this, I don't know why I put this in. But um, we still need to find one more Justimon Blitz Arms. What we might do here is Digivolve for 3. See if we can find it. Nope, that's okay. Um, we might just play down Satsuki, or we could go searching. I'm kind of down to go searching. I think we're playing this Agurumon here. And we can get rid of one of these Hover Espimons and draw two. Okay, not quite what we needed, but there is a Black Tamer there, that's cool. Um, what we might do next turn is Digivolve this Hagurumon X onto this Hagurumon. See how we go then. Okay, our opponent's going to get another draw, which is kind of giving them free value here. But we're both trying to OTK each other, so it's kind of cute. Alright, let's see more of what they're playing. Okay, this does look like Black War Green on OTK, but... I don't know, maybe there's more to this. What, what else could they be cooking? I'm genuinely curious what they're playing. 
I love cooker builds, and that seems like a cooker build. Oh man, ancient Garurumon, Greymon, Pandemonium Flame. <laughs> what? What is going on here? Okay, I'm very confused. Um, we're not gonna promote. Oh, we can digivolve into this Justimon in the back, though. I've just remembered. You can, as I showed you in the combo, you don't need to digivolve into this as part of the combo. If that makes sense, you can you can just do this to um you know kind of reduce a step a, a need for memory um we might digivolve here we get that blocker as well which is nice blocker decoy that's kind of huge probably not going to swing in we don't need to swing in ever basically so we're kind of just going to chill black memory boost please find us this last piece no it doesn't okay um that's rough I guess we take a Guru X for when we hard slam. Oh, we already had one. <laughs> oh well, I don't think it mattered what we take there because we're just gonna hard slam this Haguru next turn, and um, yeah, search and then search with Haguru X, drawing another card. Unfortunate, but as I mentioned, oh, okay, he's just got OTK, doesn't he? Yeah, we've we've taken too long. We do have this, but I don't think it matters. He's taking his own security. No, that was meant to be our OTK. Okay, so I'm guessing he's going to do the Black Wall Green Mono TK now, but I'm just curious. As to, okay, I love the Metal Cannon. That's really cool. I've, I've played around with Metal Cannon in that build, but he's playing so much jank. I'm so surprised. Okay, pretty sure we just die here. We do have Blocker. I wonder if he's accounted for Blocker. Oh, the combo kills something. Yeah. No, this Greymon kills the Blocker here, so. Say goodbye to the Blockman. Oh. Okay, he's not going to kill the blocker token. Interesting, in a deck where you're trying to kill me. Okay, then we have a black yellow Agumon. We have Agumon X, this is going to search. They're playing the Kari as well. Adding Agumon X. Okay. Metal Cannon would go off now if he's got one. Nope, Greymon again. Deleting the token. Massive. Agumon again. Gravity Crush. Blinding Ray. Oh my god. Okay. It's time for the draw. The Gravity Crush again. Alright, let's see it. Let's see it. I want to see the draw seven. Oh, here it comes. He's got a black card now. Now he can draw seven. Oh, he gets to pick up X as well. Nice. That's really big. He can put on the other Agu. Anybody as well? I don't, I don't think you need that. I guess it's another source for a draw when you play the draw spell. Here we go. Drawing nine. That's insane. Ready for this hand? No. That's crazy. Alright, we're definitely dead now. Why is he hard slammed that? I'm not sure why he hard slammed that ugly one. He's still missing something? Surely he doesn't need to keep- he's still going. Surely he's got it all by this point, right? Okay, Blinding Ray again. Gravity Crush. He needs to get into another level 4 for the Chimera. Yep, Grab Crush. Okay, drawing the rest of his deck. Ragnar Kid. Oh, recycle all the options. Yep. I mean, yeah, that's kind of insane, right? Then what, you can just draw them all again? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Gonna draw them all again. This is so silly. <laughs> I love this game. You can do some silly stuff. This is what I'm talking about though, this deck's like so slow, we can't even, we can't even hit our OTK by the time this guy does this. <laughs> it's so funny. Okay. 
Wait, did he mess up the combo? How does he push for game? Wait, what? Oh, you just hard play the metal gray for game. Yo, I hadn't thought about that. Oh, that's kind of goaded. Okay. That's an interesting spin on the deck, adding the metal gray with Rush in as well. Well, I think I've done all I can with this deck. <laughs> we just lost to the biggest jank deck. I think that might be the next deck I play on the sim, because man, is that a fun one. But anyway, let me know what you think. Uh, how are you guys building Justimon? Because I can't do it justice, which is pretty ironic. But I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.